Hit record. Okay, well, welcome everyone to the Tuesday, October 17th Festival of Chimes and Lights Committee meeting. Uh, we have but a revised Monday agenda. Right. Hmm? Today's Monday, right? We have, it's a Monday. Forget the Tuesday. <laughs> <It's like Monday. laughs> do you know what? It actually said Tuesday it on does, the agenda. Probably. And you know, yeah. I was just reading right off going, I just read that. Here I, I am. Mean, Monday. And I just duplicated the statement. Yeah. Sheila, you're the hero. Thank you. Yay, thank you. Sheila. She knows where we are. Yeah. What day? Is they that? all blend together <laughs> for me, so. Well, we would be in trouble if it were Tuesday, wouldn't we? Yes. Oh, no. Uh, okay, so um, discussion, advertisement, and brochures. We'll start right away with the brochures because. Um, it did go to press. Yay. So the last of the changes were made, and we'll get proofs out. I don't have that file. She didn't have the last file. So it's just in this little tiny baby version. Oh, that's cute. Cool. That's cute. Which is, I know. I wish. I mean, it is pretty fun, isn't it? Yeah. That's cute. I like Santa. Randy, <laughs> what's the wireless code? Yes. Um, and that's adorable. Oh, isn't it? Well, <laughs> And of course, then the announcement, because we are passing this around, is that Bruce and Linda Titus will be our honorary oh, tree lighters. Oh, nice. oh that's nice. Yes. Yeah, the perfect. timing, I thought, was very good. Didn't For all that's they've cool. done for the community in the yeah. last year, and for the path going in, et cetera, et cetera, um, they'll be fun. So I asked Bruce, and he said, would it be all right if I bought my wife? I said, that's even better. <laughs> <laughs> I just know that she'd be interested. Yes. So they will be the honorary tree letters, and we're oh, that's great. very excited about that. Um, and so the brochure will go to press. Um, we went over it and over it. In the um, utility billing statement, they were able to get it into September's statement as well as they'll get it into October's as well. Oh, that's so, perfect. Yep. So that's really good information. Um, we'll get you extra brochures for the bags. Okay, great. And um, Bruce, everybody wants to have brochures to hand sure. out. And I thought, too, we could get started, Randy, any time on those little posters we do. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, those, those can be up. printed any time. Why don't we go ahead and get started on that? We'll get the, the art changed. These Aren't these so nice to have mm -hmm. in the windows? We won't compete too much with Jingle Bell. Well, so um, I'll have... Um, Janine update the basics, you know, dates, times, that stuff, if, and then get it off to you to review before okay. we print. Okay. And then um, I can also have her send out emails to the participants asking them how many posters they want, and then we can get those Do printed the and ready for pickup. posters work the best? It's whatever oh, merchants well, want, right? I, I only say that because most of the merchants will ask for the smaller ones. Actually, and I started going to we can the do both Because liners. it blocks too much of the window. Yes. I started doing flyers instead of And they of would rather posters. have a double-sided one yes. than one that's big. So it prints I, the I, same information on both, both sides? Yeah. Because it shows okay. from the inside and out. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. They are we having does. chili? Yes. We are? Mm -hmm. Okay. That was confirmed. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Boy, you can read that, huh? Kathleen, good for you. <laughs> I'm just oh, yeah. going through it with good the glasses. Good for you. <laughs> you don't need my glasses. <laughs> <laughs> no, glasses. She's it's not reading in the dark. It's not only my second me. <laughs> Kelly, would you like a larger version to look at? <laughs> I did put it on. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, yes, then we'll get started with that, and that is a good idea. Yeah. And I, uh, I just almost city. forgot about that. but Maybe I, the bigger ones like Prismire or some of the other places. Oh, uh, I think you're right. Yeah, I've always so been a little far. worried about blocking out the windows for mm -hmm. too much. And then we have another other events going on then, so yeah, good idea. Smaller yeah. and double-sided. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. So um, the next thing we talked about is I went over um, to the Independent and I talked with Rich and Kayla. So we'll get started on the uh, pullout and get going on that too. Um, and there were some nice photos submitted this year, weren't they? Mm -hmm. I, I, it was a nice change to have something. Mm -hmm. I love that Santa photo of That's Dennis. Right. Yeah. So That's great. Nice. Mm -hmm. It just is, I think, so engaging. So yeah. I, you know, I'm, that works out really well. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. But yep. Yeah, so we'll get going on that because I told them we could probably get that done within the next week or two. So nothing is too far behind. 
Yeah, might as well keep on this rule. Um, anything to add? No, from me. Okay. Um, uh, I invited Leslie and Mimi to be here today, but oh, I yes. guess she can't come. Because she's concerned. She really wants risers for the choirs. Um, oh. And so we did that before when we used to have the choirs on the flat part. Mm. But now that they're on the slope, that's all, sort of already a, you know, gradiated. So I don't know. I was like, if you come, we can go out there and walk around and like block it out and see where, because she can arrange for the risers is the thing, because she can get them from the school. But um, but I don't know. We, ha we, we, we have done it before with risers. We used to get risers, but... Where were they placed? Kathy? They were on the where the tree is, kind of. So right in that parking lot, right next to the police garage. They were right. there, but they were also just up on the in front of the door. Kind I was of. about to say right in front of the door, right? Yeah, yeah, in front of the door where the police station is. And that was the first year we switched over to yes. there. Yes. Okay. That was the first year that we switched over. They were on risers, and then the next year was the year that I think that was the first year. Jerry was involved. Jerry was the the chair chair and we put the choirs on the grass and then we we brought in some pop-up tents mm -hmm. and then it was really windy mm -hmm. and it didn't rain so we're like oh the pop-up tents are looked complete waste of energy and but the choirs on the grass worked really well I thought but the choirs don't like it as much so I don't know I'm not sure well, the main problem I know that we've talked about is visibility. And when you start putting tents up and everything, you start blocking right. the view because everyone's down here. Right. We're, we're up here. Right. And then you start, you can't hardly really see the tree. You can't see the people very well. Well, yeah, I mean, I think if there was a tent, like a big tent, like a tent. We talk of, we're talking about 20, it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Over the choirs and they were in the, you know, still in the grass, not on risers. I think that would work. I think the more important thing for them is to be covered. To be covered? Yeah. So are the risers covered? The risers would just are just risers. Oh, okay. So, okay. so then they would still need so to be So the hi. people on the... Hi, welcome. Sorry for me. So the people on the top riser would be... I know. Touching might the be top touching. of the tent. No, those 10 by 20 are pretty tall. Though. Yeah. Yeah. It would depend. You know, I mean, I mean those are... Here, you, you use one over there, don't you? Yeah. Well, and, and I saw... I was glad to see you have it on here, because I was going to ask you if... But we can talk about it when we get okay. to that. But, um, okay. but that, that, those are pretty tall. They should yeah. still be able to fit in oh, there. This is actually what you need. Yeah. I think we, we yeah, this, this is just a oh. reference thing. I think you could thing. look at it, like, block, block it out a little bit. We were going to go out there and see where we could put it where it wouldn't block the view of the okay. tree. Okay. Um, and then I can tell Leslie. Because the sound has to be up there, too. Right. Mm -hmm. And he always has a tent. Yeah. He does. And, he's, and so it's sort of like where the sound guy was, that's sort of where the risers and the tent were, like, that one year. Mm -hmm. And it, I mean, it was okay. And then we had the, we used to have the choirs back in the corner. Right. In the parking lot, in the, like, the police station parking lot. You wouldn't hardly see them at all. Wouldn't. No, it was really bad. We yeah. really do want them to be visible. It's a lot better mm -hmm. because the streets weren't closed. Mm -hmm. And so now that the street is closed, yeah. they can be up and people can stand in the street and watch them. It's just so much better. So tent versus risers. Yeah. We could do both. I mean, if you can do both. Well, how many risers do they need? Would this be the... The biggest choir has 50 people. That's the Sedgwick okay. Blazers. And what are they, like three? Are they three risers mm -hmm. or three or four? Three. Steps up, three? Yeah. So do you still, uh, I'm trying to think, so do you still want them next to City Hall or yeah. are you wanting out by the triangle? No, not by still the Still at City Hall. One year they were out by the triangle. Right. Do you remember that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but we have, to, you know, we've got to think of sound, the speakers, the I can't remember. everything, <clears throat> and getting run over by the fire truck. Well, we'd it would be on a different route. It'd be on a different road than the fire truck, but um, 
the plug for the chimes and lights is over by City Hall, and the point of having the choir is by you know all that. So I that's think, kind I of mean, what and, the, and the kids out community choir is leading the sing along. Uh, you know, as so you want them all thing. together. Yeah, yeah. It makes sense. It makes I think more where, synergy. I think, I think where they've better. been has been really good. Okay, but they just don't feel like like they don't. I think they don't feel like there's enough change in elevation on that sloped hill, so that like the kids, especially that are in the back row like their parents can't see them as well as if they were on risers i don't know and they're used to performing on risers and so ideally well, they would be on risers but i just don't know if there's room for risers and a tent and have them close yeah. to the tree yeah. right so probably it's going to have to be one or the other and i think they would prefer tent protection with yeah them from the elements yeah mm -hmm. over yeah okay. i mean i would if it was like last year yeah <laughs> it's not going to be like last year. <laughs> well, yeah. which brings up, I was wondering, because we are looking at renting a big a big tent like we did last year, would you have any need for that? I mean, would, would that across serve the any? Street? No, yeah, I mean, to have it over there. I couldn't remember if there was anything that really takes place. Would you, if they were willing to leave it up longer, would you need I think they used it. Did you have it up later last year? Because I thought that they had used it for some sort of shelter or cover for when the, the people were waiting for the hayride. Well, that's what I wonder. Oh, that I mean, how big is it? Well, the one we used last year was 20 by 40. Yeah, it's big. Because wow. I heard it was beneficial, but you know, I that, remember well, that's, that's what, what it was I from, but I, I don't know. And so I, but we need to arrange that if if you want to use it. Last year, it just took them. It wasn't necessarily arranged for it to stay up longer. Oh, it just oh, took them. Oh, it took it took them. them. Yeah. Okay, so that's and we're not right. using the same company this year. Okay. Because they have chosen <coughs> to not work in the winter, mm -hmm. so I'm having to get someone out of Polsbo to come down here, and we're having to pay a traveling fee and so all of that. Out, yeah, they're closing for the winter. They're closing oh, November oh. through like. February or March. Wow. So they are not, yes, so I'm having to pay more for the canopy because it has to come from Palsmo. Oh dear. Hmm. So, so the Gone fishing or something? Just, just, I think I'll just leave. It's not worth it. He said his it's exact words worth were, it. it's not it's worth his time. It's not worth it then. Because hmm. yeah. the quotes that we got for the tent were from the, the Kiss Up event. Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, I, yeah. You don't have the other one in town here because. Yeah. <clears throat> so that means that we could use them. them. Hmm? When did, did you get them? Uh, I don't know. I mean, Janine you... sent this uh, about two weeks ago, Maybe but she may oh, not have. She, and he said he would. Well, you know what? These may just have been off the website. Oh, okay. and yeah. She probably just went off this website. I didn't and ask yeah. about them. He because so. when she had that, she sent it somewhere. Maybe it was in the minutes because that's. Chris Stansbury came back and said, towards the bottom it said that someone was researching campies for the choirs. Please note that POBSA has a 10 by 10, Sydney Museum has a 10 by 10, both Beck and I have 10 by 10s, and that we loaned out for Taste of Port Orchard or the Jingle Ball Run in the past. Also, the chamber has access to several 10 by 20s. Yeah. We're so, using, we're, the Jingle Ball Run's using the two 10 by 20s. From the chamber? For, mm -hmm, from the chamber. Hmm. We could and just, then, yes. I wonder if we could get those transferred over. Yeah. At That's least one. one. You could pick you could literally pick up those ten by twenties and walk them across the street. And walk as long as it's not windy. Well uh, yeah. but, I mean if you had someone on each yeah. leg. Let's do that. Let's yeah. do that. And they'll already be up. And the so, so good. Okay. But do you want the big tent to still Yeah, why don't we keep that? Up? It's even on the map Hayride route, right where that tent is. Okay. So but they might have to come the next day and take it down. Well, that means so yeah, there's I mean, extra charges, right? So you'd have I to would have to check into it. I can check. Well, well we were probably going to be having to rent a tent anyway. So can we well, find just, out what the extra charges she, would be, yeah. Sheila? Yeah. yeah. But okay. I wanted to throw that out there because I thought that it kind of did get used last year while it was still up, well, you know and I was what? like, well, you know what? That would be nice. Could, really nice. Something just, we could share. So I guess know. if you can confirm that one, that the Port of Bremerton doesn't mind if it's going to take out. She lives. Out. She's already got one rented, and it's coming from Palsbo. And so what yeah. she's talking about is if she left her big tent up. Right. I got tent tent, yeah, right. for it. It's not like you were asking for another tent. Oh, well, no, no, no. No. Because well, we've got, there's, she's using also yeah. two of the chamber tents, the 10 by 20s. That are going to be transferred over here. That we'll just city transfer over to our event. 
Who's open? Who's uh, in business to rent tents in Paulsville? Uh, they're called. Um, We're the only ones, so take it yeah. or else. Yeah. <laughs> I, gosh, I, their name is. I can't think of it right now. But they have like, um, uh, t you know, like uh, rentals for equipment. You know, like the like United Rentals. Type yeah, of thing. and then they also have a party side. So and we'll transfer and have to from be Jingle only Bell. Ones then open in the winter. Pretty much. Unless you want to go to Tacoma. So Sheila, what time could those be moved? The ten by twenty? Well you only need one, right? I think so. For the choir one ten by twenty. Mm -hmm. So those could be Gus brings his own tent, right? Yeah, he does. That so could be moved. Santa. Yeah. Well, between three thirty and four is when we are taking down and loading okay. everything up. Three thirty. That's perfect. Because yeah. The first choir starts at and I will call Colesbo and see if they can stay up through 4 30. the next morning. Would probably be, and then I'll call Wait, Kathy. Four is the first choir, so we would have to oh. end. Okay. So three thirty. Oh, that's fine. We're, you guys were always taking down. Yeah. Right. At three thirty, and literally you would just have to find get it across people, the street. Yeah. Pick yeah. it up, and, and so that's what we need to confirm. What what who's going to be moving and who, the tent from Jingle Bell to, at three thirty? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get the tent, move yeah. it over here. Well, you know what? Get We're the, supposed to have the Washington Youth Academy here oh, helping yeah. and the um, ROTC. Yeah. So, so I'm sure at 3:30. I'm sure we will have volunteers there that could just pick it up sure. and move it for you guys. Okay. Um, and then you'll will you also confirm the, uh, with the chamber that we can use one? It'll yeah. be from the I'm yeah. sure it won't be any issues. Right, because then we have sure. to think about making sure it gets taken down and where we put it and all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's a pole tent, so I mean it's a little bit more to take down you know what i mean mm -hmm. it's not just like a pop-up it's a 10 by 20 pole tent can we so. put that right in the entryway does it have a back for that night until i don't think matt has any sides for it okay i don't think uh sides come with it okay that's fine we'll just need to figure out and i don't know that we can have the sides put up without getting a tent permit Okay. Well, and that's okay because you know what? Then there's a problem with blocking the view. Yeah, then you well, you can't see the tree, yeah. you can't see the kids. Yeah, but well, I guess depending on where it's. Uh, that's okay. I, we probably shouldn't even bother with that. So but. take the ten by twenty and move it to in front of the entry down here mm -hmm. and just store it, and then that's where the choir is going to be. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. So, and you're going to arrange for the movement and then now we just need to figure out who's going to take it down at the, after the event and yeah. make sure it gets back to the chamber when they open up because yeah. they won't be open the rest well, of the weekend then. yeah right so take down well it'll need to be dried out yes and matt isn't going to be here that weekend he said hence that leads us into our next so i'll ask public works if they can take it down mm -hmm. store it yes and get it back to the That'd chamber yeah okay, okay. Perfect. The what? The 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 it's the mock. The chicken logo. It's the mock for I know. I know. Okay. I know. Oh, I know. I cleaned up my original shirt. I was like, what are those eyes? Yes. Like, we're using the old banner one more year. Mm. So the, you know, the, the pretty logo will be on that, but I know. And on the Pepsi trucks, but yeah, I know. It's it is what it is. is. But it, yeah. I just really enjoyed the, yeah. The yeah. Port yeah. Orchard um, one. Yeah. yeah. So, oh well. Yep, oh well. And then if you can just let me know if there's any additional or extra charge for oh, yeah. the yeah. evening okay. of the 10 by one, 10 by 40. No, uh, 20 by 40. 20 by 40. 20 by 40. Yeah. And then if there is, maybe hopefully you can create an invoice to the city. Okay. Thank you. Is that how you would want to do that? Is have Walk us? the invoice either if, if there's charges. Yeah, I think that makes a lot of sense though. Yeah. Well, but we can't pay for it and then invoice you. The arthritis foundation won't do that. It would have to be. We could probably get two separate invoices: one for us for our share, and one for you guys for your share. Yep. Okay. Yeah. All right. So invoice from the vendor. Yeah. So yeah. If you can just let me know if there's a cost, and so how okay, much, so we'll, I can make sure it's within the budget. He might just throw it in, okay. but I don't know. Okay. But either way, I make no promises. Okay. okay. Well. <laughs> and if it well, and also if it's going to be you know an ongoing. Um, uh, Necessity of the chimes and lights. Then moving forward, we should, you know, okay, quote it accordingly for the mm -hmm. next year. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. He might prefer to come back the next day. Anyway. Well, that's what you know. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Considering you know. So all right. Well, and then to kind of finish the bunny trail, because Matt is going to be gone at the chamber, he will not be able to manage the Pooch and Purse Parade, and um, 
originally he thought that maybe the Humane Society would be able to take that on, mm -hmm. but they really do want donations. Mm -hmm. And so it's left now that the Humane Society may or may not have that parade, but the mention of it will not be in the brochure because it will be a fundraising event if they do that, and that didn't. Okay. Um, that can't be mentioned. What about what about like cookies, pet corner? Would they be interested in running it? Um, he was going to be asking around a bit, but he said the big thing is is that he's not going to be around to coordinate yeah. it. Okay. And that a couple of years ago they had a number of issues. And a bit. Yeah. And they don't want to have it again. So I said, okay. Well, so upset about their pets. what I did on there is just take it out. Good idea. And if people. There will be people looking for it. The pet parade? So it's not going to be on the brochure? It's not in there. It's, it's on there. Well, yeah, it's, it's out. On it's there. out on the revised. Oh, okay. Yeah. Even the, tra the tracks? Yes. So the Humane Society will be the only ones advertising it? If they have it. And he wasn't even sure of that. So, so they won't announce the winners? No. At City Hall? So then the choirs could go longer? Well... We'll have more going on on the stage. Okay. Um, Bruce will probably be talking. Okay. And there'll be just more. But yes, basically the, the choirs could have a little bit. Well, I don't think we should tell them that we can extend it because there's so much movement involved and we barely get it, everything done that we need to. And we will be filling the time in with that sing along. So. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. I think we're fine. Okay. Yeah. So, you're, so this isn't the final final then? Because it's on I make that. Yeah, it is on It's there. still on there? Okay, yeah, it's no, it's, it's been taken off. Registration, it's a bank drive through. Yep, nope, it's and not then on it's on there. here. Nope. Have parade winners announced. All gone. Okay. Everything that has to oh, do with... Oh, everybody's going to be sad. I know. That's too bad. Well, and maybe what we need to do is start looking for someone else to take that over. Bobby, we do you have any have suggestions? too many last year. Well, and that's, an, that's well, another problem. So bad, yeah. Well, I mean, we had, what, 10? <laughs> At the most. Yeah. Hardly well, and then they were charged a $10 fee. That's why. Right. Yeah. You know, everyone that. was surprised. I never knew that either. Yeah, no, well, that was the first year that it ever happened. Uh -huh. And then when people got up there to register their pets, they were told they had to pay $10, and they were like, no. Right. Mm -hmm. So they didn't do it. Yeah, so the bunny didn't make it. Yeah. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Whoops. The parents didn't come. There was quite a few. <laughs> well, and, and Matt said it was getting more difficult to try to find prizes and yeah. that kind of thing. Yeah. Um, so I think the interest is waning a bit. So if somebody else wanted to take it up, I suppose we could advertise next year. Maybe when Petco comes in, they can... No, I think <laughs> Cookies should take it up. I don't think he will. Have you ever met him? Uh, yeah, I talked to him all the time. <laughs> I go in there all the time. No, if it's sounding good, tell us all about it. Okay, uh, <laughs> he, he has a better contact. I can so. see. I went in to ask for a, one of those uh, electric or battery operated litter box things for yeah. cats. Oh. oh my word, he told me about all, everything I needed to know or didn't really want to know about one and how I should not buy one because they were not good for cats and it scares them and blah, blah, blah. I was like, oh, wow. <laughs> he's, he's he's have he said, Do you? I did for a while. You didn't like it? No. Do you have one now? No. Yeah, it's a waste of money. Hmm. <laughs> it's good to know. It's good to know. Good to know. He he's from special. experience. Well, so I, I, you know, I think we need some time. Yeah. I think it would be great. I think that would be fun to have him sponsor it. We can ask him about future, yeah. in the future. But for now, we won't have a pet parade, and usually it was the chamber advertising it, for the most part. Maybe yeah, it'll have, have to be the Humane Society if they do it, right? Right. And I haven't heard anything. I bet Matt was kind of saying he doesn't think it's going to happen. I, yeah, it doesn't sound like it. I've asked him a lot, you know. It's just so weather dependent, you know. Mm -hmm. That people don't want to bring their pets out in costume. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's raining. Yeah, right. True. There were dogs and they were just shivering. Oh. You know, yeah. some they stuffed them in their jackets. <laughs> <laughs> the judges were shivering also, <laughs> and I did it oh, three yes. years in a row. Oh, you did it, buddy. And it was one year freezing, the next yeah. year pouring. It was well. Hard maybe work. that can be continued in the future. Yeah, sure. And maybe we could have it. I don't know inside someplace, who knows? We don't know what's gonna happen downtown. Yeah. So, but I just wanted to let you know, it's not in the brochure. Okay. Everything about it has been taken out, including the pause. Okay. I know, it's kind of sad. Um, 
All right, uh, tent. Well, that's a good solution. Yeah. I like that. Um, logistics update, we're pretty much doing that. Anybody have anything else to add? You're busy at the library. Yeah, we have a lot of musicians booked now. Oh, so, do you? Doing that yeah. all the time? Mm-hmm. No, I only I, listed the... I know. I, yeah, but we've booked more since then. Have you? I mean, we. it says music all day. It so, does? Yeah. Okay. Um, as soon as this gets on the website, let me know. Because then I'll put a link on our website. I'm trying to link as much as I possibly okay. can, like dragonfly <coughs> stuff. I think last year all we really linked was the festival itself. And this year I was really going to try to get every link possible, whether it's the library or the drag dragonfly or oh, yeah. whatever, on our website, trying to encourage people to Didn't stick it, around for all that. Confirm the... Express? Yes. Okay. Oh, good. That's good. Yeah, and it's all listed too. So. Yeah, I know <laughs> what we're doing. Yeah. He is so nice. I know. He's so oh, nice. he's perfect for the dragonfly. Yeah. Yes. Oh, Nick? He's great. Yes. He's really yeah. Wow. He wants to uh, redo the face of the building and make it more opulent. Hmm. You know, he wants a mural on the side. Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah, it would. That's what well, I Well, anything, that, that thing looks like a big box of mustard. Yeah, it does. It does. That's <laughs> true. The mirror would be perfectly appropriate there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That would be very nice. Yeah. And, I, and I hope you can buy the building someday. Yeah. That would be, that would be yeah. really cool. Boy, he's perfect. Okay, so let's see. Public event application, October 25th. We're going to mm -hmm. see that schedule. Okay. You see that on the table. Or anyone who wants to take a peek, I've got two copies if you want to look at that. Um, it's really pretty close to what it was, a few additions and then a few subtractions. Um, but it's a wonderful schedule. There's so much going on there. Yeah. It's going to be a really neat event. And the choirs, I think, add so much. Uh, the dance gallery confirmed their performances, too, those two performances that oh, they good. always have. Mm -hmm. And they wanted to know, we've got to make sure that the music doesn't start too soon, too. Um, Gordon Sam. Oh, yeah. Yeah, remember? Please. Yeah, remember. Uh, what time do we want the uh, Gordon Sound to start? Not before. Not, yeah. What, 3.30? Yeah. 3.30. That's perfect, because the choir started at 4. Yeah. So not before 3.30. Not before 3.30. I mean, and then people, um, people were lined, lined up trying to hear us tell them when it was, you know, time to go for the run, and he had his music blaring, and people couldn't hear. Oh, no. Yeah. Yes. So not before 3.30, yeah. and yeah. then it needs to stop by when? Uh, or does he go all night long? I would assume no, not, he just, right? he fills in. He yeah, he does. Works. Oh, fills And he's in. right there by us, so he's he's really good about that. Okay, so it was just the starting. Yeah, just the gotcha. starting part. So, <laughs> like, when a choir is taking down and another one is coming in, he can fill in with a couple of songs, mm -hmm. and that's perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And he's got, he's all ready for that. Yes, yeah. he's been doing that. Okay, so I'll just make sure that the only thing that's gonna change from him filling in the music is just his start time. Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah, that was a real problem. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so you're announcing winners at like 3-3? Three, three? <sighs> you know, that has always been an issue for us, because the, those winners, they want out of there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, so I just hand them their medal at the very end, <laughs> and mm -hmm. they go. Yeah. I mean, because we just really have the top three female, top three right. male. So I think that actually, we we haven't yeah. ever really done a, a formal announcement. No. Yeah. They people are so cold and wet. Yeah. They, they just want to leave. Yeah. Well, that was part of the problem with even announcing the pet parade winners. Yeah. Yes. You know, no. to, get, really to really get the really information really there soon enough, yeah. Yeah. and then you know, oh, to make sure their animals were still alive. I, I think the main, <laughs> thing, the main thing for the runners is they just want to see it on the website. Yeah. yeah. As long as it's on the website, that's all they care about. Yeah, that's it's true. It's not like they feel like there needs to be a formal, yeah. here's, your, here's your medal kind of thing, yeah. you know? The Olympic right. goal. You don't have the, the platforms? And the no. Nothing? Maybe someday. <laughs> no, <laughs> the they're adults. adults. They're all yeah, adults. They don't want it. Yeah. Well, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, anything else? Um, just the uh, next meeting dates. So, November seventh and twenty-first is what I'm proposing. If you don't have a preference on whether Janine, Janine or I be here, um, I'll be. Um, You'll be gone. I'll be on vacation the seventh, but Janine can be here. Okay. And then on the twenty-first, she's gone. I'm here. So uh, perfect. One of the two will be here. Okay. 
Seven. Well, why don't we just go ahead and set that because then the next thing we know, it's Thanksgiving and yeah. it's gems yeah. and lights. Yeah. So two more meetings to just kind of iron okay. out details. Seventh and the twenty-first. Mm -hmm. Okay. And three thirty again, please. That'd be great with them. You know, on Tuesday. <laughs> well, I was here at three fifteen. I, I had written it down. Three fifteen. I don't know what I was thinking. Because you're just putting yourself ahead. I think I was. I think yeah. I was. And actually, Sheila, oh. that. That really solves quite a bit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Share the chance like that. So thank you. Oh yeah, yeah. So that's great. Still three thirty. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's it. We're done. Yes, we're done. Meeting.